taking a step back in time. A local film restorer has uncovered more than three hours of never seen before footage. These films are living photographs. They re really are important. The films date back to the early 1900s, each reel containing more than 30 minutes of footage. And these were all the films that were shot in the, the 1950s, 60s, 70s and even 80s. And they cover all the periods that we're talking about. They cover lots of history and they will cover their family's history as well. This film showing the Kiwi ingenuity of locals. Well, it's about an electric car. He built an electric car, which was quite an amazing thing in those days. Dated in 1945, when the war was wrapping up, you can see old Kaipui in the background. After driving down the road, the electric car parks outside of Kaipui's old Rialto theatre. That's one of the things of old film. You can't save it forever. Larry Jamison's the man behind restoring the historic footage. He believes there are more lost treasures like this one out there. There are absolutely masses of films like this that are lying around in people's garages, in biscuit tins, in shoe boxes. Uh, they're all over the place and many of them are now been left and just discarded. Jameson's been working in films since his teens, sparking a lifelong hobby in restoring old footage. What I'm enjoying is seeing these wonderful historic buildings and places as they once were. But not only am I seeing it like that, I'm seeing how people actually enjoyed them and the fun they had and watching people on the trams and things of that nature. So it's very, very interesting to me. Immigrating from England in 2009, Jameson purchased an old Sintel machine from Sir Peter Jackson. Weighing as much as his car, it took up most of the space in his double garage. After being broken in the 2010 earthquakes, the machine he's restoring on now is only one of two in New Zealand. The 2010 and 2011 earthquakes also changing the look of Kaipui and Canterbury. We're all looking forward to uh, our new turn, towns and our new Christchurch, but preserving our past is very, very important and that's what these films do. Jameson is hoping more locals will come forward with old reels, revealing more history from olden day Canterbury. Okay. Emma Cropper, CTV News. It's an English car, obviously. Looks like an...